Hello, Detective. I was wrong to expect that my voice returning would solve all the problems. Someone's trying to harm me again. All is lost, and I have no one else to call since Guillermo is on a business trip. Please come to the TV center. I'll be waiting for you in my studio. Thanks for coming on such short notice. You see, me and my band are going on tour. Well, we were. Until someone stole our documents. I came here and saw all the chaos. But besides the mess, the intruder left behind a threatening note in the safe. He hinted that he knew about... my... other nature. Please help me find this lunatic. He's clearly plotting to ruin our tour. Even trash the rehearsal stage. Take a look at it as well. <sighs> 
I had no doubt that an experienced detective like you wouldn't want to miss a single detail.
Oh, you've already collected all the evidence? <sighs> Good job. A pinch of magic and whoever left their trail behind will be marked on the photo. Wait, I saw that man. He's a fan. My guards had to detain him several times when he tried to get into my dressing room. This man demanded a private meeting with me, chased me down, and harassed my assistant with endless phone calls. All that's left is to get to his warehouse. Our documents must be at his house. You should track down this madman before he hurts the members of my band. I never thought of that. You're very astute, detective. Let's say, if that guy, Aquilin, is not just a fan, but one of the others, then I might be important to him, as I am to all sea creatures. Such a blessing that you're here. Take it. It'll be useful.
Kuhn. That's him, and he is one of the others. I can't let you take the documents back, Ribeira. Looks like he's a merman. Since he hid in the water, you'll need to learn how to breathe under it again. So you have to cultivate some mermaid seaweed. Rebeira, I won't let you leave Rio. Come on. We must get him as well as the documents. I am impressed by your strength and agility. Now all that remains is to handcuff him, so he won't be a threat to me anymore.
I'm sorry, my queen. I've caused you so much trouble. I tried to warn you not to leave Rio, but I couldn't. I was banished from the sea, so I live here in the lake. Your guards refused to speak to me and threatened to beat me up if I came near you again. I found ancient scrolls and learned that you're not allowed to leave. As soon as you depart, the sea will rise up following you. Your voice must always remain here in Rio. Oh, Great Neptune. I had no idea. Forgive me, if only we had talked earlier. Then I have no choice but to stay here forever? Don't despair, there's hope still. I tried to tape the singing from your concerts, and it didn't work. Maybe if you perform in the studio, and we can make a clear recording of your voice. Then the sea will be calm. <sighs> this problem will be so easily solved. I've set up a little recording studio on the premises here. I use it for recording the sounds of the botanical garden. Here, take this. It'll come in handy to get there. It's here. Before we go in, tell me, detective. Am I such a bad queen? If I never knew I was not allowed to leave Rio? Thank you. I'm so glad you understand.
right? We're ready to record Ribeira's voice. Just curious. I know I broke the law, but I was trying to act for the sake of the sea. What will you do to me? I thought you were going to arrest me. You are truly the kindest and most noble person. I promise I won't fail you. I'll face the judgment of the others, knowing that I helped to save Rio. You are the best human, Detective. Thank you for saving my tour. My tour was wonderful, and it's all thanks to you, the Record Keeper. Thank you, with all my heart. I am honored, my queen, but if it weren't for the detective, I would be in prison. So I am also grateful. 